You're watching Greater Brockton, Mark Lindy, your host, and it is that time of year again. We have the Black and Blues hockey, but this time it's a special one. It's the 25th anniversary, and here to talk with me about it is Peter Crump. Peter, welcome. Welcome. Nice to see you. Good Thank to you. see you. Um, you've been doing this for quite a while. Yeah, we started, well, we started in 1983, but we got uh, hooked up with the Bruins in 1988. So we've been around for a little bit. Now, why do you do this? Why do you do what you do? Uh, we just have fun doing it, and we're able to raise funds and uh, make donations to all the various charities and uh, the, the, the surrounding areas. We give quite a bit to different Brockton groups. We give some to the uh, veterans groups. We give a lot to uh, those that have a medical need. So we, uh, you know, we basically try to find people that fall between the cracks that can use extra money to help them out with their organizations. No, you're retired police officer from yes. the city of Brockton, and black, that's kind of where black and blues black and came blues from, come from, correct? Yeah, yeah. If you remember that old show on TV called The Hill Street Blues? Sure do. Well, with the black and blues. Okay, just in, in, at the end of the game, you know, you... you, you we'll you, probably you, feel that more than we uh, you, wear it. Now, how many people are involved in black and blues? You, you also play Bruins. I mean, re retired Bruins play. Yes, yeah. I've got about... Uh, 27 people on my team mm -hmm. in any given time we do the different tournaments and games like we just finished the irish american hockey tournaments up in southie mm -hmm. and the team came in second place in our division uh, we've traveled over to russia a couple of times we've uh, had a real good time a real good trip most of the guys that went on these trips they all pay for it themselves no one in this company or this organization makes any money or any profit from it matter of fact for this bruins game each player is bringing in 200 dollars cash to defray the cost for the ice and the referees and the things of that nature. So the event itself is uh, Sunday the 17th of April. Yes. Yeah. What time does it start? Well, the puck drops at 5.30, but the gates will be open at about 5 o'clock. Mm -hmm. And uh, we try to get in there and get the people set up, make them feel comfortable. And it's at AZF at Arena? AZF Arena, behind the high school. And from what I remember, the ticket price is the best show in town. Yeah, tickets are ten dollars for adults, five for children. If anybody has a team, they like to make some, get some team prices. Then give me a call, and uh, we'll take care of them on that. Leave the tickets at the rink for them, or I'll bring them to them. We invite the VA patients down. Um, I call those guys the forgotten wounded warriors, mm -hmm. and we invite them down free of charge, making big donations to them, both here in Brockton up at West Roxbury. A couple of years ago, we bought some sleds for their uh, people that have a the sled hockey. Oh, neat. That's getting to be a much bigger program and starting out in this area, too. Now, you said people can get in touch with you. Tell us your phone number. All right. Cell phone is 508-326-8601. Okay. And uh, um, I don't know, if is there anything online? Is there a web or anything? No, like we that? don't have any of that. Okay. Uh, we just never got into the business of that. We're Okay, well, one of these days we're going to help you set up a Facebook page. I think it's yeah. that important because, you know, people look for events. Nowadays, half the invitations I get in the mail, yeah. I don't get a paper Online. invitation anymore. <laughs> I get an invite on Facebook. But, but anyway, so um, tell me what you get out of it personally. What, what, what does this for you to have done this for 25 years? Well, I just enjoy the fact that I can still skate at 73 years of age. Mm. Uh, I started skating in 1958 in Brockton High and uh, just stayed with it. Get interrupted by military service and things of that nature, but uh, it's been good and uh, it's something we can do easy. And the more you do it and put it together, and if you enjoy it, it's not work, it's not a chore. Although there are times when you get a little bit frazzled, but we've got the permission from the Attorney General to solicit funds. We haven't called any families, we're calling only corporations and companies. Mm -hmm. And all the money's raised now, uh, there's no one else doing it but myself and a few of my men on the team. So we just uh, go and play. If Which is, for charities, unusual. Usually charities go out and raise money. A lot of the cost, the charity, it doesn't even go to the charitable cost. But yeah. this, is a this, this is 100%. Yeah, we're, we're not that big. We're not uh, small enough to do anything like that. So we just enjoy putting it where it's going to do the most good for some people who have a need. Now, who from the Bruins alumni, can you reveal any of that? Well, I know that uh, Rick Middleton will be there. Andy Brickley, unless he's doing something for the playoffs. And we'll have Gary Doak, uh, Shoe Bottom, Ken Lindsman. There's quite a few coming, but we never, we're never sure on who's going to show up. Last minute things happen. 
Well, this is the 25th year. Uh, Rick Milton said he's going to do something special. I have no idea what it is. Uh, he's probably going to get me a pair of Snickers because I'm uh, older than he is. I'm older than the alumni, so. Wow. I don't know what they're going to do, but it should be a nice time. Now, I understand one of our favorites, one of my crew that covers this every year, and we don't want you to just watch it on TV. We want you to go to it, yeah. support it, buy the ticket. It'll be available later on to enjoy, but um, there's a, a, a famous <coughs> singer yeah, yeah. who's he's, there. Ray he's Rancourt, uh, he's from the town of Champions, and he sings the anthem like it should be sung, in my personal opinion, a little bit of military pomp and pageantry. Uh, he does a great job with it. We've had other people fill in when he couldn't make it, and they do a great job, but uh, it's just like he's a natural for it. And we've been doing it so long with Renee that uh, we've become good friends. A couple of the uh, people in other organizations I know, we get together once in a while on Natick and have breakfast. Mm -hmm. so. so what you said a few minutes ago kind of rings with me, the, the VA patients. Okay. Yeah. First of all, you give money to the two different hospitals. The yeah, we donate to the, the patients' Rockstar. accounts. Did you get a lot of the VA members there? They'll bring a bus down, mm -hmm. and there'll be maybe uh, anywhere from uh, 10 to 30 in the corner. It is access available for anybody that has a handicap. Right. Uh, wheelchairs and things of that nature. Uh, they take their spot. They've been coming every year. It's, it's just a, it's a nice time. You are going to see more people getting involved with this uh, special programs they have for the people playing sled hockey. Mm -hmm. Kids that are deaf can play hockey and kids that are blind can play hockey by the use sound and light systems and such. That's going to be making an appearance out here in Brockton. Um, it's going to be a good, a good thing, I think, for everybody to get involved in that. And it's a real family thing from what I remember going to some of them myself. You, yeah. you know, it's mothers, fathers, sisters, brothers. Everybody comes out. I mean... Yep, they all come out. It's a nice hockey. time. Um, so just to, just to recap one more time, it is Sunday... April 17th, uh, the puck drops at 5.30, the gates open at 5. It's at AZF uh, Arena right next to Brockton High School. Ticket prices couldn't be lower, $10 for adults, $5 for children. If you want to get a group together, you can call Peter at 508-326-8601. And uh, Black and Blues Hockey, what could be better? Not too much. Thanks, maybe, that, maybe another championship for the Bruins. <laughs> Sounds good to me. Sounds good Thank to you. me. Thanks for being on. You're Always welcome. glad Thank to you. promote it. You're watching Greater Brockton. Mark Lindy, your host. Stay tuned for more events, places, people, and faces right here in the City of Champions.